That's why I'm saying some of these outfits, it's like your friends and family saw you walk out the house looking like this and they let you go. That is how you Lusaka July. Mm. Should have stayed home, should have stayed home. See my bad and bougie. She won't drink on Tuesday. A shoddy sipping on a bumbe. A long way from cooler. See my bad and bougie. She won't drink on Tuesday. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel. It's Kay here. Today I have a very fun video. I've never filmed one of these. This is normally my sister's thing. She's done this for like the past two years, but this year I wanted to join in on the fun. <laughs> Today's video is going to be a Lusaka July fashion roast. If you are easily offended, just walk right out of this video because I promise you, you will be triggered. So I'm giving you time to exit the space before you get your feelings hurt. As you know, I attended last year. It was quite fun. The theme of this year's show or setting was heaven on earth. Some outfits were given heavenly goddess. Ooh, others were giving hell. I think majority of people just didn't know how to dress for the theme. That's like a problem I've seen with like Lusaka July is because like Lusaka July is meant to be like a Met sort of thing, but people don't really understand the themes. But some people definitely understood the assignment and we are gonna clap for them today. Oh boy oh boy, I'm gonna start with the guest of honor. Um she was not on theme, not one bit. The only way I could say she was on theme is if she was trying to go for you know how God created all the animals on earth, so in heaven like they're all the animals that's the only like reasoning i can give behind her look instead of having something that someone has to think so deeply to explain just dress on theme but my good sis showed up in like you can see in like leopard print is it like leopard cheetah print mm. I, I, I don't know she was she definitely missed it i understand what she was going for you know animals in heaven but She's so gorgeous, she could have done something so exquisite, but she decided to go for this and for that, like, miss. Next up, we have Miss Mumpy. She looked gorgeous, like, she is so pretty and, like, everything tied together so well. The makeup, the fit, I just don't know why the fit was pink, that, that's it, but otherwise it looked so good. She is gorgeous. Next up we have Tintin. The outfit was really cute. I just didn't really like um, the like ruffles because they're giving me shower thing. You know that loofah you bath with? Mm, maybe it's just me. But honestly, it was such a beautiful outfit and she's so gorgeous so it just tied together so well. Maybe I would have cut back on the ruffles but otherwise she looked amazing. Next outfit we have is this one. I have no idea who this is but this outfit should have stayed at the tailors. I don't know why it saw the light of day at this event, although her hair looked so beautiful. The hair, so nice. I like the little clutch and the jewelry. It's just the dress itself. I don't know what is happening. It's It literally looks like my curtains. That is it. I've been, try I've been looking at this dress trying to see what it reminds me of. It reminds me of my curtains. I'm not even joking. Next up, we have this gorgeous outfit. The outfit was absolutely peng it did not miss i loved the headpiece everything tied together so well she's so beautiful and the dress it just mm, chef's kiss Mwah. the only thing that actually someone pointed out to me was the shoes the shoes did not go with this dress not one bit but otherwise the dress itself gorgeous i honestly have nothing to say for this outfit I don't know why anyone would leave their house looking like this and everyone who saw you walking out of the house was like, yeah, oh my gosh, you're going to Lusaka July, you look so nice. It's just not giving. I honestly have nothing nice to say. Can we all take a moment? Take a moment. Miss Melba. Oh gosh, she looked absolutely beautiful. She is so peng. Like, what? When I saw her pictures, I was like, Finally someone who has taken my breath away. The dress was just giving everything it was meant to give. The detail on the dress, Miss Ma'am came in clutch. Here we have a picture of her with the guest of honor, I believe, special guest, celebrity guest person, and she just ate her up. She ate her up, left no crumbs. I love the slit, she's giving leg. 
the hair looked so beautiful the dress is honestly spectacular the heels matched with the dress chef's kiss i think she may be like honestly the best restaurant let's see let's see next we have the host of the event i don't know I don't know, honestly. Okay, the one in shorts, it just wasn't giving, not for this event, not for a heaven on earth type of event. The other dress though, like the proper dress, that one is cuter, but still I don't think it fit the vibe for the event, but that's just me. We have Mr. Vanilla Zaddy himself, Mr. Bobby Daywalker, Bobby East. Ah, one of my favorite Zambi musicians, he is just the one. He looked so dapper in his suit, like, he, he didn't do too much, but he did just enough, you know what I mean? He looked really good and I commend him for this outfit. Next we have Chucky. Chucky was in this nice fitted suit. It looked really nice. It's just, it was a little simple for me. Like I feel like he could have done more, like you could wear a suit to any event, but what you do with the suit. But I mean, it was tailored well, it fit him well, but I think he could have done more. Like he can dress, so I wanted to see him show up. Maki too, Maki too, Maki too. Yeah. If you don't want to go somewhere, just stay home. Like, what even is this outfit? I don't know why a man wore a bomber and like, what? What even is going on with these pants? I'm genuinely shocked looking at this. Like, bruh, he should have just stayed home if he really didn't want to go because. This is giving me Skr Skr was invited to LSK July and decided to show up at the last minute. It's just not cute. He could have gone for a tux or something, but no. Oh no, and the pants have like shapes on them. Honestly, it's, I blame his stylist. I doubt he came up with this by himself. How are you gonna let Maki 2 go out looking like this? Next outfit we have is Flo. She looked really cute. It was simple, but again, I feel like it could have done more. I mean, the theme was heaven on earth. The possibilities were endless, but it was just a simple tuck suit. And I mean, it looked good. The hair was the accessory, but maybe she could have had like a headpiece to add, but we have Zambia's sweetheart, Michi. I think the dress was so cute and she is gorgeous. So it just looked so nice on her, but I don't like the bottom half of the dress. It's just not giving. I feel like it shouldn't have had those ruffles. It would have looked better if it was just body hugging and went down like that. And maybe again, a headpiece or something to bring out the Shwear, you know, but I think it's a really cute piece. Her hair looked really nice. It tied together this auntie mm, This auntie was invited to a wedding and she showed up at Lusaka July instead because it's giving me Matron Matron. Mm. I don't know. I don't know, bruh. That's why I'm saying some of these outfits It's like your friends and family saw you walk out the house looking like this and they let you go. Mm -mm. It's literally giving me kitchen party, wedding, one of the senior aunties on the council because stop she also has like the oh no we have this little nice gold unit i'm there's something i don't like about the dress i can't tell what it is but there's something i don't like but i do like the leg action going on and the hair and makeup tied together well here we have some guy i'm sure he's important i just don't know him he looked okay he looked okay he kept it simple with a suit i feel like he could have done more as well but he looked okay fitted tux it was it was a cute moment miss bombshell grenade she honestly looks really pretty there was just something i didn't like maybe it was i don't know what it was but there was just something i didn't like about it but i have to say it did deliver, she looks really nice. The outfit is giving me, I am the moment. I am here with the little cane thing, like, mm, watch how you talk to me, I am your boss. This outfit is giving me King George. Like the whole like thing around him, that's it. I don't know, it's giving me Chief, King George, 7th century, something like that. I feel like minus the like whole coat item going on on him, it was a nice outfit but that ruins it for me. I genuinely hope these guys were a part of the entertainment because this is, it just missed. This outfit, mm, I kid you not, I have a rug that looks just like the bottom half of this dress. The top half of the dress was cute, the bottom half ruined it for me. 
I think they're trying to go for like a dove heavenly type look, but it just wasn't executed properly. Oh, Shakira, Shakira. She looked so gorgeous. She's literally so beautiful. And the dress, although simple, she knew how to accessorize it and make it look, make it look, the words not coming, but she knew how to make it look wow, extravagant, you know? She kept it simple, kept it cute, just a bob, nice dress, wings, accessories. She killed it, absolutely killed it. Plus that body, that is how you Lusaka July. Next up, we have this dress. It was also very simple, but what could have been done to make it look better would have been like Shakira's type thing. She had a headpiece, but the headpiece could have been more dramatic and something else going on. I think it was a little too plain. These guys should have stayed at home. That is it. I'm sure they just woke up and said, oh, we got Lusaka July tickets, let's go, because what even is this? Guy is off theme completely. The girl, you could tell she tried a little, but still you could see it was a last minute thing. Mm should have stayed home should have stayed home this outfit is giving heaven on earth the wings bruh she said i am heaven on earth and the thing with an outfit is even if it's like a bad outfit although this one is not i feel like if you own it it will look good and she knew how to own it she knew how to work it per everything tied together for this look the hair looks gorgeous the headpiece was giving me everything and more the dress, the detail on the dress is, you could tell that time was spent on this dress to make it look like this. And then you add the wings. Chef's kiss. Next up, we have this outfit. This is giving me all white party with my friends on a Saturday night, not Lusaka July. No, this outfit could have remained in the archives, not for Lusaka July. I feel like it's not giving, it's giving night out on the town with my friends or let me take Instagram pictures real quick. Not heaven on earth. This auntie, this is another outfit that should have stayed in the closet. And she, you could tell she was so proud of it as well, stop. Again, the pants are looking like my bedroom curtains, I'm not even joking. And I don't know what's going on with it being tied around her neck. I mean, the bag is cute. The bag and the shades are cute, but not for this event. We have Ben Lumbe next. First, let me compliment him before I get into other things. His face, it ate. This man, he knows how to make himself look good. That's for one. The eyebrows are perfectly done. The base, oh my lord, the base and the eyes. It looks so, so good. I have to give him that. The hair too nice fade it's a fresh fade and you can see he gelled it that looked really nice now I'll come to the outfit itself it's giving me the new collection of adidas i don't know i i don't know the thing is these people can dress and i know they can dress but when it comes to lusaka july i get disappointed which is what upsets my spirit because they look so good when it comes to their instagrams or just everyday life then you send them to lusaka july and they pull out this you know it really is giving me adidas newest collection with the three stripes going on everywhere i hope he didn't come up with this himself because i genuinely hope he has a stylist to blame these next outfits they're simple and cute but but what is going on with the the corset i don't know why she added a green corset to this outfit maybe she was trying to be like green for the garden in heaven i don't know but that is what ruined it completely for me there was no need to have that green belt on otherwise i feel like more could have been done but for me that just ruined it this guy Mm. The tux, I understand the concept of a tux, like it's just simple, you can never really go wrong with a tux, but I feel like he went wrong with the tux here. It's more, it's more like he's on a wedding lineup than at Lusaka July, if you understand me. I have high hopes for him, I feel like if he attends next year he'll outdo himself, but I feel like this tux for heaven on earth theme, not giving. This outfit I saw like right before I was about to make this video. I was just scrolling on Twitter to see if I could find any more outfits and I was like, what is this? Can someone explain to me why she has red sunglasses on at a heaven on earth themed event? 
The math is not mathing in my brain. The dress itself is cute. It's just the way it was accessorized was done wrong. That's it. Lastly, we have this gorgeous outfit. Whoever this is, she killed it. It's simple, but it's elegant and it is giving. That is how you do simple, you know what I mean? So when you you go for a simple outfit, it's either your hair is being your statement piece or something. And my good sis, she did what she had to do. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope I wasn't too brutal. If you liked it, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up and comment down below which one was your best dressed outfit, which one was your worst dressed outfit, which outfit did you like, which one did I not see the vision of? Let me know. My best dressed outfit for Lusaka July 2021 Heaven on Earth is but I'm a tie between this girl and Miss Melba because they absolutely ate. No crumbs left behind. They ate. My best dressed male has to be either Vanilla Zaddy or Chucky because they just, I, well from the outfits I've seen they were the best ones and that says a lot. My worst dressed outfits, drum roll please, are See you guys next time. Bye. Came in and I took your shot it like a robbery. I